So we have here with us Yao and Jackson, this is some of our dancers from the Hong Kong Ballet, and I want you to hear a little bit from them, where they're from, when they joined the company, and some advice for you at home, how they're staying nice and strong and positive and their body healthy, so when we're ready to go back to the theater, you can enjoy a great performance. So do you want to tell us a little bit about you, Yao? Uh, I'm from Sichuan, and I graduated from Beijing Dance Academy, and, and after that, I joined the Hong Kong Ballet. And how long have you been in Hong Kong Ballet? Uh, it's fifth season. Great, here. great. Are you enjoying it? Yeah, so much. I feel time goes so fast. I bet, I bet. So any advice you have for our viewers about you staying strong and positive to get back to work? Um, during the quarantine, uh, we take class every day on the Zoom. But at home, we, we only have Small, we, we, we have small space, mm -hmm. so we only can do bar with a chair and wardrobe, something, mm -hmm. yes. kitchen. <laughs> and after class, we, we, we have a Pilates to train our core and other muscles for keep our stamina. And sometimes I also go to uh, hiking and running outside to nice. keep my energy. Nice, yeah. very good. See, so if you want to see Yao out there, go on a hike and keep the fresh air so you run into her to get positive and keep dancing. Okay, Jack, tell us a little bit about you. Where are you from? When you came to Hong Kong? Um, my name is Jackson. Um, this is my first year in Hong Kong and my first year with Hong Kong Ballet. Welcome, um, welcome. Good to have you. Yeah, happy to be here. Um, I'm from Canada. Um, yeah, anything else? Yes, what have I been doing to stay positive and healthy and sane during this quarantine time? Yeah, just like Yao mentioned, um, we've been really fortunate to have a Zoom class each day with Hong Kong Ballet. And not only does that keep us in physical shape, but it's nice to connect with all our colleagues. We don't feel so isolated anymore. There's about a five minute window right before class when you can sort of see each of your colleagues maybe hear a little bit of music or see someone rolling out of bed so it just it i think it helps make it a little bit more lighthearted and you have a sense of community um gives a bit of structure outside of ballet um just like yeah actually <laughs> been doing a lot of hiking hong kong is great that it has all this beautiful you have this urban jungle and then you have uh natural beauty um, lots of trails and you can really challenge yourself um and then I've been doing a lot of cooking, just trying different recipes online and yeah, just trying to keep nice. myself busy. So we have a chef and two hikers. So if you <laughs> want to connect with the Hong Kong Ballet besides the theater and here at home through the dance videos, go on a hike. You run to one of these beautiful ballerinas and ballerinas and all the great community that we have here in Hong Kong. Together we'll get through this and I hope you enjoy meeting a little bit about Yao and Jackson and also enjoy the workouts. Take care of yourself and we'll see you soon. Bye. Bye guys.